Episode six of Skybot. So uh, last episode we built the uh, upgraded the uh, uh, cobblestone generator. I've uh, done a few home improvements since then. A little bit of work around the house. Uh, built up this wall here, and uh, everything seems to be working fine. I've blocked this tunnel down there, filled in the hole I kept falling in, and made another path, another route for me to get up on. Right, today's episode, I want to do a couple of things inside. First of all, I want to move the bed upstairs. In fact, we can do that right now. Uh, I'm going to leave the spawn point down here. And, oh yes, I've uh, opened it up up here as well and made it a lot bigger. So, uh, nice big bedroom there with a view across what I hope to be a lot more land. So that's that stuff. Right. Uh, so a couple of achievements that I can do in the challenges. I've got 64 wheat now in my inventory, which means I think I can complete the uh, wheat farmer. Uh, challenge wheat farmer. So let's check it to see. Uh, wheat farmer. There we can see that I need 64 units of wheat. I can complete that now. Um, oh. um, and there we go. I get a little bit of money. Experience. And what does that do to my island level? We're now 128. 120. I thought we were 129 last time. I'll have to check back on the video. I think we were. Right, so today I would like to go down and um, expand that platform. <coughs> Take it out further. And in order to do that, I need to empty my inventory. The chest is no longer big enough. Let me make another chest go alongside. There we go. And that will enable me to empty stuff out of my inventory apart from this stuff. Sun's about to go down, so I can place a few blocks, I think, before sunset. Let's do that. And that's all I need to do it before I drown. the edge again. Yeah, that will do. Yeah. Today. Uh, if I pull this water bucket back in with the water bucket and reset the water, that will make a much nicer stream. Now it's night time. Hopefully, I can sleep. Uh, 
There we go. It's morning, daylight. Right. And <coughs> fuck it. Okay, well, let's do a quick bench outside first, clear up any mobs that we've got. Good for my bow. So, quick breakfast. Breakfast. Some toast in the morning, shouldn't it? Now, I want to reset that water. flow in a different direction and allow me to expand out off the side. Well, we'll see anyway. Maybe not. Maybe not. Put the bucket back in the, in the chest, keep it safe. Set it, did it? That's better. This way I can get past the waterfall, hopefully. Don't want to put those blocks in. Reset it. Ooh. Oh, goodness me. Put my finger off that key. I accidentally pressed the mouse button on place two blocks. You know what? I've got enough wood here. Why don't I just build uh, a ladder? Take the water away and build a ladder. <coughs> Down to the platform. Get away. 
build a set of ladders. <clears throat> 21 should be enough, that's more than enough. Those ladders will come in use later on. Gosh, the sun going down again already. Very short days here. Very short days. I just messed that up. I think I have. I think I have. Yeah, so the shift key will stop me dropping any further. Let's go do that. Just reminding myself what the keys are. Uh, ow. Well that's one way of doing that, I guess. You know what? I could just go into the side of the mountain here, couldn't I? Except I now no longer have tend to do now is build a build this platform out as far as I can from the base layer here. And I will be doing some more water scaffolding later on in the episodes because uh, I need to get down around about the height of 30. Let's just have a quick look. What are we, what's our height here? Our height here is 119, so I need to go down 70 odd, 80 odd blocks to get down to level 30. And the reason I want to do that is because that's where the uh, slime is. Yeah. Slimes down, I think, between level 36, is it, and level 45, something around that. So I need to get down to that sort of level if I want to set up a slime farm in the future. And also, the lower I go, the more height I've got to build with. So, for instance, if I wanted to put in a iron golem farm, I could build a multi-tiered iron golem farm as well if I can get right the way down. Pretty scary stuff. Um, so now I think what I need is some um, cobblestone. Uh, again, I'm gonna let you fast forward through this. While I do my cobblestone generation. So there we go, it's the uh, cobblestone generator, and through the magic of this recording, you see we have a full inventory of cobblestone. Just gotta get those remaining pieces that are out there. Yep. So 
my intention is to uh, drop down onto the platform now and build out. I am not going to take all this cobblestone uh, with me. It's the last thing I actually want is to get knocked off the platform and lose it all. So what I'm going to do is just take a little bit down at a time. Um, put all my cobblestone in here. I think I've got enough now actually to make a start on the... Um, Dark spawner. So I'll take two stacks down with me. Should be enough for now. Build out. I want a new. I'm going to take my sword with me as well. And I've got a bow, oh, so. A pickaxe, I mean. I've got a pickaxe with me. I hate ladders almost as much as I hate um, water scaffolding. Yeah. But what um, this does give me now is a nice solid platform from which to build out. Maybe set up some farmland and build that dark room spawner that we were talking about as well. One thing I will need to do is light this up because the last thing I want is to be spawning. Until I'm ready for, for them. So, here's my neighbour's house. And I will correct that uh, issue there with the multi tiered levels. Build out, build a nice jetty out here from my island, and uh, on top of that, I'm going to put my dark spawner. Uh, we seem to be losing light, so I'm a bit worried. Getting caught down here and having mob spawn, so I need to get this layer down. Get some torches down and then get back up to a relative safety of um, that tree. One thing I will point out is that was a really stupid place to build the um, cobblestone spawner. And the reason being is I had no end of mobs dropping on my head from above. Near a skelly somewhere. It's a bit worrying. I bet it's down in the cave. There we go. Next to skelly. Uh, yeah. So let's go sleep again and then go down and do another layer. Okay, it's now night time. Take some more under the uh, loot I just took from that. Take another stack down with me. I want to check there are no skellies up here before I head off down. Let's see if I can get on the ladder this time. There we go. That's better. That is a lot better. And yeah, this one will never need to jump 
join up without losing too much cobble, hopefully. My um, ladder, isn't it? So we need to... Oh, I nearly fell down that hole. to place a block there. It just seems to be there we go, that's better. That's nice. Now I feel a bit more secure. to the platform. It's not what I like to see. So, anyway, let me speed through this and uh, I'll get back to you when it's done. We have sheep, <laughs> which is good. I need to cut some trees down and put some pens out for them, I guess. Mm. seen that before. <laughs> okay, let's put some pens out, see if we can get those sheep corralled. Where did they go? Ah, here they are. I have something that they will like. There we go, which is great. Come on. Put 
this out. Put a block on that side. Where's my sheet? Come on, back up here. See you, Mr. Creeper. There you are. You got yourself stuck down here as well, haven't you? Come on then. Success. I hope. Soil away. Dirt, sorry. And do I need to put some more torches down here before nightfall? Probably. What I think I'm going to do is put a temporary wall around this, so that if any animals do spawn down here, um, or when I do move animals down there, there's no danger of losing them. We've got plenty of cobble at the moment, so let's make a set of walls to go around the enclosure that I've got down there. trees. It's just not top priority. At the right. Nice. Okay, and I think that's enough for today, this episode. We've got the platform built. And, uh, that means that we can now use that platform to build the dark room spawner. Yeah. Zombie. And I want some gate posts for this so I can get into the ends as well let's do that quickly before we close this episode right so plans for um 
plans for that platform now are to put a dark dark spawner up there so that I can get rid of that tree that will stop um, a lot of the um, mobs spawning here and if you control the environment which I can gather loot from the mobs as well um, so I'll do that next episode okay so join us like subscribe comment um, if you've enjoyed the episode um, please click on the like button and um, see you for next episode on uh, Nightcraft. We're playing Skyblock on Nightcraft.us.